Guys, what is up? So we are back and yep, I forgot the babies are still crying because they don't do anything else because, you know, babies and that. Um, so we're going to have Florence come and do this, which is probably extremely unfair, but them's the breaks. <laughs> Oh, this is so cute. She is genuinely such a good big sister. Okay. <laughs> Danny just swanning up like he's got loads of swagger at Jagger. Oh, so cute. Now, yeah, give him a bottle. Yeah, because unlike The Sims 3, they don't actually tend to cry when they're lonely or anything. It's just hungry or um, stanky. When they got that stanky booty going on. Kian looking like an absolute badass. I'm looking at the board, as I always do. <laughs> okay, put him down, then deal with your sister. I don't know, do I want you to go to bed? Yeah, we'll send you to bed. Because you have got school in the morning, young lady. Um, kind of my fault for keeping you up, but we'll ignore that for the moment. So what are you doing? What am I doing? Yeah, if I deal with that, no. Doesn't want, yep, not hungry, no. T that was the okay baby. And you just woke him up. And daddy dealt with... <laughs> daddy dealt with Nova, I think. I don't know if he actually changed her nappy, though. I are confused. Okay, now... Oh, my... Liam, why have you... Why are you being a trouble child? I've reached parenting level two, so I can influence to do homework, firmly tell to do bad behaviours, and select more options when responding to a teaching moment. So Danny has just buggered off without doing anything for the baby, so we're going to have to change Nova's nappy. Change my grand baby's nappies. Why can't you... why can't you go to her? What... what is blocking you? I don't understand. There's literally nothing blocking you. You, you could just walk straight forward and you'd be alright. I don't... You find a way to get to it when it's the globe, so... Come on. Don't. Don't do this. Okay, so Olivia is going... Are you gonna... Oh! Change the nappy. Seriously, will someone just change this baby's nappy, please? Olivia, change the damn nappy. <laughs> Literally, she's got green funk coming off of her. She does not want to be bounced. She don't want to be fed. Yeah, we go. I've got to tell you, ain't I? <laughs> like, if your baby stinks, it probably needs its nappy changed. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think that's a fair assumption. Okay. And finally, there was peace in the Restrick household. <laughs> oh, God. Actually, you know what? We're going to give her a change of outfit, I think. I'm feeling like the whole Daisy Duke booty shorts. They're okay for a while, but I think... Yeah, oh, there we go. Um, yeah, I think she just kind of needs something a little bit more... Um, I just don't want to say conservative, but you get what I mean. See, she is she looking fan AF. Fan AF fam. Right. I'll give you a schmoochy schmooch. Because if I remember, oh, we became good friends with her. I'd hope so. You've been, you've been closer to her than any man. <laughs> La, bruh. You've got four kids. I, I'd hope you were slightly close. Um. Yeah, because these are romantic. We're gonna hug lovingly. Because I think it's such a cute animation, even though it's just the hug animation. But you know. Um. Hmm, what we're gonna do? So many choices, so little time. Uh, we're gonna embrace. 
<laughs> because they've they've kind of lost touch with each other recently, I think. Barza, so sore. <laughs> and they've been together for so long. I think they've started to you know, forget to appreciate each other. The romance has gone a little bit since the babies have been born. So we are going to have them have a chigaloo woohoo. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, they could just keep hugging. Feeling them coconuts knocking against his chest. I got nothing against him. Right. <laughs> Gonna go woohoo. Oh, they're so excited. It's been a while. <laughs> well, I say it's been a while. It's been about three days sometime, maybe. Oh no, it's one of the twins started again. You gonna go and deal with them? Oh wait, oh. Oh, is something really awkward about to happen right here? Something really awkward is about to happen, isn't it? Oh no, I'm gonna walk in on them. Oh no. Oh no, mama, turn away! <laughs> Just walking in on uh, people doing the horizontal tango. It's even worse when you're related. Oh, please, please just do it and bugger off. <laughs> oh, Nova. You couldn't just keep quiet for a few minutes, could you? Now you had to interrupt mummy and daddy bonding time. <clears throat> I'm assuming she's hungry. She's not going to go in while they're doing it, is she? Okay, this should be asleep. Everything should be fine. I'm just going to be super embarrassed. Oh, but no, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm very easy going. Oh, cuddles with Nanny. Even though I don't think she wants cuddles, I think she just wants to be fed, but that's just my opinion. Hmm. It is cute for the bonding, I guess. Okay, back down you go, and then we're going to feed you a bot bot. <laughs> Even though you've almost been exclusively breastfed until this point in your life, so you know you're getting older. <laughs> Time to get you used to it. Oh, look at them. They're like a couple of love-struck teenagers. Okay, is he going to go back to bed? Okay. So she's going to browse the web for something or other. She was pleasantly satisfied. Good, good. <laughs> um, yeah, cannot unsee. Yeah, you were never meant to see that, babe. Right, what are we gonna do with you then? Um, hmm. I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, out of all of um her kids, my sim self is definitely closest with Olivia, hence why she's moved in with her. Okay, where, where are you going? Kian, why are you still up? Okay, you're getting in line where no one else is using the slip and slide, but okay. Wait in a line if you so desire. You and your other personalities. Oh, you're playing arithmetic attack, so you can you can keep going. My clever little my clever little man. Right, even though you're gonna be super tired for school tomorrow, but oh well. We'll deal with that. <clears throat> Why do you just want randomly want to wash your hands? I guess it's very good practice after using a communal computer, but see, they just autonomously want to do it, and I'm very confused. Oh, the lag was real there. Her <laughs> parenting expert confirmed, so she was browsing parent forums, which is a really cute feature. I must admit. Oh, I, I, I didn't even have to tell him. Kean's going to go and play with his doctor 
bear kit. Um, I think with Kian. Oh, go, go and play. It's okay. You can you can go and play with him. I think I want Kian to potentially become a doctor because um, little Berry Bear over there says it's perfect for aspiring doctors or veterinarians, which is making me very hopeful that there is going to be a pets stuff. Well, won't be a stuff pack; it'd be an expansion very soon, which I'm. I am ready for. I'd prefer seasons first, but you know, I'll take what I can get. See, this is so cute, Olivia. Yeah, you, you go to bed, love. That's fine. See, it's so cute. And it works on their empathy so that they... It's just so cute. I love it so much. He's just trying to work out what's wrong with his teddy, and I think... I speak for most of the population. When I was little, I always used to do this with my bears. I'd always play doctors. I also used to have a little um, insects. I used to call it like a um, holiday camp. And now I think about it, it was probably <laughs> more like a torture camp. Um, yeah. You're going to go to bed, mister. I used I used to like finding ladybirds and making little sort courses for them. Yeah. <laughs> it's only now as I'm older that I realised I am a terrible human being. But oh well. <laughs> I was young. Okay, what are you gonna do? What you doing? I mean, it's your room, so theoretically you can do whatever you want. Hmm. Oh, she's playing The Sims. Um, we're gonna have you browse the parenting forums because, as much as she loves her grandkids, you know, girl, it'd be tough. Yes, yeah, so such genius, clumsy. Hmm. Okay, that's what's going on. Yeah, she's just having a good little... I think I'm going to have them go volunteering, so I'm going to pin that. Mm, how many more points have I got? 25! <laughs> okay. That is slightly less than I was expecting. Even though, I think with The Sims 4, there are less things worth having in the reward store, if that makes any sense. Because before, like, you had something that would wipe your reputation clean, you had a cloning thing, a fountain of youth, a career boost, I think, um, with university you got an honorary diploma. And now it's just like, oh, would you like a sleeping potion for 250? I'm like, mm, okay. I don't understand how to get her emotional control up, because she's very responsible. That's definitely her highest one. And I think that's Kian's highest one as well. So, you can increase that by saying please and thank you. You can... In mm, volunteering. With this, it's winding down on... So, like, playing instruments and stuff. Okay, so, that would also be, like, the, um... Dog to clear mind thing. Leave the board alone! Look at the drawer and then if it gets it off the board, look at wherever you want. Because mate, you're looking me de you're making me <laughs> I can't even speak. You're making me decor look messy, love. <clears throat> I forgot about this little tattoo. It is one of my favourite Sims 4 tattoos, I will admit. I don't have any tattoos myself, but I'm living vicarious <laughs> I've lived probably is the operative word vicariously through this sim. Even though I don't like needles. Ah. Well, I don't mind needles. I can have like blood tests and things, but uh -huh. it's more to the point I don't want a needle anywhere near me unless it has to be. And tattoos to me just. Well, I guess they're okay for expression and stuff. Wait, when did. Wait. 
I'm, I'm going to return to my detour very quickly at some point. We're going to set the curfew. Right. Shut up. <laughs> Whichever twin it is. Um, we're going to write a note for Kian. But I swear, I never see them putting up these drawings. I don't know where they get them from. Olivia's parenting level 5 so she can ground kids, discuss bad behaviour and hug it out. And she has more... She has access to more ways to solve kids' motives. Ah, oh, Snape. Yeah, I never see them make these drawings or anything, but they're really cool. They're aesthetically pleasing. But yeah, as I was saying before, I think tattoos are a good mean of expression. But knowing how changeable I am, I would get something and I would absolutely hate it, <clears throat> and I'd be stuck with it for the rest of my life. And yeah. It's just not worth the hassle. Um, so I probably... I I will never get a tattoo. <laughs> I am very sure in this fact. Put this up here. Okay, where'd that go? Um, correct angles made by me. Right. That's cute. Picture of a blossom tree. That's nice. Why will you not sleep in your damn bed? Oh my god. Why do you keep going into your kid's bedroom? to go to sleep on their footstool. I don't... I don't understand this. Um, you're grungy. You're a teenager. That's almost uh, your constant state, isn't it? <laughs> or is that just me? I don't know. Okay, so she's tense. Don't know what to have you do then. You're very tense. Eek. Uh, oh, that's a low fun bar. Um... I don't even have that much time, so I don't know what I can get you to do. Um, you haven't even started your homework yet. Jesus. Um, I guess we can have you play a game or something on your phone just to tide you over a little bit. Even though you're stanky. But we'll have, we'll have a go with this so that you're not totally depressed when you go to school today. So she's a B student. But she's doing very well. I'm very proud of my little Florence. You might have noticed she's also got another haircut. She's decided to dye her hair. Because, you know, life is for living. And she's always worn a lot of blue. So she just thought, might as well just dye my hair blue. Okay, so now we're going to make some sack lunches. We're going to make a tuna salad sap. Oh, she's been promoted to social justice worker. Right, um, so she will now earn 42 simoleons an hour. And she got bonus of 275 simoleons. Oh, nice. Nice, my girl. You are doing well. Um, we are going to send you to work. Because, mate, you're, looking the, you're making the place look untidy. Um, I can check course progress. Nice new stuffing freighter sim. I'll take that, thank you. Uh, starts an hour, starts an hour. So we've got an hour to make two sandwiches. <sighs> no, how long it takes them to do anything. I, I'm not particularly optimistic that we're going to get it done, but you know, as long as one's got a sandwich. Way I understand it. Hmm. Yeah, I can't remember what I was going to say then. Short term memory loss. <laughs> um, right, yeah. Danny, you go change Nova's dirty nappy. What are you doing? I'm going to go and have a bubble bath. Your thumb's up slightly. You, you got pee really bad. Oh yeah, I remember what I was going to say. Oh, Simba. Um... They only eat the packs um, lunches if they're hungry. Oh. So sometimes they will come back with their packed lunches. But that's just because they haven't been hungry during the day. Oh. So you probably want to send them to school a little bit hungry. If you want them to eat the um, packed lunch. Oh, now we've got to deal with this debacle, have we? All right. Maybe you just chill in the bath, love. Don't worry. Okay. 
<sighs> Who do we give this to? Do I give this to you? Yeah, we'll give it to you. And um, we will... Yeah, okay, you've got it. Good, good. Um, make another pack lunch. Oh, God. It always does this where it takes, like, an age to transition between sims. And you can select everything, but it's just... It takes a while to acknowledge that you've shifted from one sim to another. So you're off to work in a minute. Now, Olivia, I'm going to need you to make another sandwich for your son. Oh, no, you've got to go to work. Oh, you start at eight, don't you? Mmm. This is a difficult situation here. Ah. Oh, Liam, please be quiet. <laughs> I'm trying to work out how to do this. <laughs> the stress is real. Okay, you finally got the hang of it. You are off to s Oh, I'm not going to be able to get you your sandwich, am I? Because you can't give them their sandwiches while they're at school. Ah! Okay, I'm just going to have to hope that Liam isn't too hungry. <laughs> or he's going to think his mum and dad don't love him anymore. Oh, the stress is real. I'm asleep and I think we are going to go volunteering today because you know in, in retirement there isn't really a lot to, well I mean she looks after the kids but she needs you know that little something extra to keep her her mind busy. Um, we are going to have her, what are we going to have you do? Um, mm, because you can volunteer at bait sale, volunteer at a beach cleanup, nursing home, soup kitchen, or you can do a walk. So we're going to go to the soup kitchen. Because I have a friend who actually um, volunteers at a food bank, which is not exactly the same, but it's a similar kind of principle. So, Danny, you're having a bath because you're stanky. Get the stank off you. Okay, so we're at level two. Uh, I just need to reach level two of the charisma skill then. Haven't updated our social media status either. Eek! Okay, there's a bit of the uh, Ken doll nakedness there. If you'll excuse that for a minute. Uh, we're going to have you wake up because you are sufficiently energised. Even though if this was me, it would take me a lot longer to get out of bed. <laughs> okay, yeah, you go off. Danny is off to work so we're gonna go off volunteering and the babies are gonna go to daycare you know to not because we just want to get out of the house no it's it's obviously to socialize the babies so that they are familiar with other kids okay yep yeah, Liam and Nova have been sent to daycare well in good hands that is a very relative term because I have had babies come back from there both hungry and stinky. Like, oh, it's almost their birthdays. Okay. I might take the executive decision to age them up then. Okay. Um, they've been returned. Volunteering is fun and builds character. Okay, so she's feeling pretty good about what's happened today. Her back's gone. <laughs> This is like me at the age of 19, so you know. It can only go downhill from here. I'm gonna bottle feed you, then we're gonna rock you. Rock a bye, I'm gonna rock you. Rock a bye, baby, rock a bye. Yeah, just, just do all the things. Now, now, Nova, you're being the problem child. It was your brother a while ago, now you've. Now you've started acting up. What is this? And so she seems to be, <laughs> now she's our bottle fed baby, Liam seems to be our breast fed baby. So we shall see. <laughs> we'll do a little experiment, see which one is the clever one. <laughs> uh, I'm kidding. Or am I? These are the questions. Yeah, put her down. She'll be okay. You're grungy, but you're a goofball, so you're kind of okay. You're extremely tense. You're probably just going to have a nervous breakdown. Uh, Olivia is happy. 
I should gonna have you work hard. Yeah. Um, we're gonna have you work. Uh, research stories actually. Yeah. So then you're both kind of trying to get ahead in your careers because you know, although we've got a lot of money, there's still the kind of thing if you you want to be successful, even if you've got a load of money, there is still the element of wanting to have achieved things I'd imagine <laughs> I don't you know have 50,000 simoleons sitting in the bank <laughs> but I'd imagine they could probably both live very comfortably even if we just didn't work but it get boring I think go a little bit stir crazy okay so baby is asleep <laughs> Nova is asleep. Liam is awake, but he's not causing any trouble. Um, <clears throat> I am focused, and I'm going to go and play some chess. Because I am bougie AF. <laughs> oh, that's me. Bougie. Bougie to the core. <clears throat> right. I'm going to go have a little sit down. Everyone should be back soon, I think. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe they'll never come back. Maybe they're gone. <laughs> That's always my first thought if like, people are late and they haven't mentioned anything. It's probably really bad, but my first thought is, oh, they're probably dead. <laughs> always the first thing my mind goes to. Probably says more about me, I'd imagine. Yeah, you just you just sit there, hun. You'll be okay. Is this fun? <laughs> Riveting gameplay. <laughs> yeah, keep playing. It's good. It's fine. Oh, someone is supposed. To... Okay, everyone's back. Okay. So Florence is still a B student, and still super tense. Um, <clears throat> Danny brought home one hundred thirty-eight. She brought two four nine. Yeah, so every everyone's kind of so so at the moment. You all right, Kian? I was uncomfortable. I'm guessing, <laughs> hence the interaction. Um, encourage, encourage good grades. Yep. Oh, he's stanky. <laughs> he's a stanky little creature. Did you pick his nose right then? Like, wah. Okay, now you're going to encourage. Oh, she doesn't run away. Going to encourage Florence to get good grades, even though she wants to play The Sims. Shouldn't be a battle of wills there. Oh, what are you doing? What you doing? We're going to cancel this. Just because I'm interested to see what he's going to do. Hmm. Where did you get that chocolate sauce and flour from, young man? And why are they now bleeding into you? Right, we're going to discipline. Oh, what are we going to do? We're gonna give him a time out because why not because I think grounding might be a little bit harsh at the moment but he is most certainly gonna clean that up she can oh she's level two video gaming okay cool good to know get a promotion you've only just got one calm down <laughs> you're getting a time out boy sit and think about what you've done Mmm. Fire. <laughs> yeah, he's just thinking, I'm going to burn you. I'm burn you all. Oh, it's cute. So they get a little circle and they've got to stay there for a certain amount of time. Oh, that's cute. I really do love this parenthood pack. I think it's, it's definitely one of the better ones. Definitely. But then again, I guess it suits my gameplay style, if that makes any sense. 
So I tend to focus more on families as a whole. Oh, and there is an ice cream van outside. Hey, okay, can he actually leave? Huh. Well, we're going to have him stay until the end of his time out. Even though he's sad. He's sad because he got a time out. Oh. <laughs> Kian, you were being a little dickhead though. I'm, I'm not saying it's your fault entirely. I'm just saying it's 90% your fault. You brought this on yourself. Okay. Sure. We're gonna ha we're gonna move. I'm not gonna do it off screen. Actually, I I, I don't know. Ha because there was a house that came with Parenthood, and I'm I kind of want to check it out. I'm not gonna lie. Because as things stand, I've kind of got to divide rooms anyway to supply for the kids and. <laughs> the adults that are actually here um, yeah when the twins age up I'm not gonna have any space for them so I think there should be enough room in the house that came with the pack but I'm not entirely sure so this this could go very well or this could go very badly that's all I'm gonna say you might have noticed I have like mother loaded because I want to be able to afford the house <laughs> um, I'm gonna change their funds afterwards I think so we shall see so here is the commodious residence it's homey and has got fast internet um, and it's four bedroom so that should be okay four bedroom three bath okay uh, we will yeah we'll keep our furniture just in case. This is really exciting. We're moving into a new place. It's a new start. Can decorate the nursery. Nursery for our little monsters. And I think with the new house, I might have to age them up. I don't think there's anything else for it. Mm. So I might might leave this cut screw. Oh no, okay. It's okay. I lied. I lied. We're here. Okay, so this is our new crib. This is so cool. Like, we've got a big TV. We've got our little living... Well, yeah, living area. This really cute little country kitchen type deal. With attached dining area and like some some kiddie decorative items we've got one little toddy bed so we might have to we're gonna have to change that up anyway we've got master bedroom ensuite kiddie bathroom teenage room which seems like it's gonna be perfect for her already and we've got a little kids room so this is pretty much all that we need and there's the little table of lego slash not lego um blocks this is so cool this is so cool even though i don't know where the babies have gone where have the babies gone so this is the result of what i did off screen i added another bedroom because uh <laughs> girl there weren't enough room for me there was um <laughs> there's enough for the um for Olivia and Danny and the kids but not so much for old Nan over here so I had to add that on we've got a doll's house and a little activity table it's just so that they can work on their skills like that we've got a little school project thing which you can buy from buy mode we've got a void critter thing <laughs> kind of thing we've got a little potty in this downstairs bathroom so that we can potty train um, we've got a little office over here um, yeah so babies are currently in their nursery but we're gonna have to age them up I'm thinking um, but they've got their little beds did a bit of redecorating 
for Florence's room and I love this wallpaper and the lights it just looks so cute and it's so her like and this is a little Kian's bedroom yeah this is so cool I I'm loving this so far got a little wabbit tablets they've got a TV in their room which I don't think they can be watching for a while but they've got it all the same and the little ensuite and the little whales which I think is so freaking cute um, but anyway I think I might leave it here guys I'm not yeah I think this is a good place to end it we've moved into the new house and I might save the ageing up for the next part so I'm going to leave you guys to speculate in the comments um, what the babies are going to look like whether either of them is going to be a ginger whether um, <clears throat> what's going on here oh yeah I, I'm, I'm kind of excited to see who they're going to look like what they're gonna look like it's an exciting it's an exciting time and i'm just gonna leave you with this last little bit of the tour bye guys